Just smoking some 1792 flake in the little Westminster pipe. There he is, lovely little pipe. Oh, I'm really tired tonight. I'm sort of mentally tired, not physically tired. <laughs> Just done four or five hours painting. I'm painting the uh, that riverscape that I was showing you not long ago. And it's quite a task really because there was quite a lot of reflections in it. Well, actually, the picture I was working off one had taken on the on the Lancashire River, the River Hodder. The actual picture didn't show a lot of um, boulders underneath the surface. But I just wanted to make it look like a shallow river so it was a bit of a labour of love. I think one more session and I should finish it. I'll probably put about 16, 17 hours in I think. So I think concentration makes you tired than digging a trench. Oof. I don't know that for a fact because I used to dig a few trenches in the old days when I was on the tree job. Often used to get trees in winter and we used to heal them all in. They were all for the streets but we heal them all in and place not far from here, not half a mile away. It's, it turned into a wood, woodland. Should put the video up underneath it actually. I did a video in uh, I think it's 2009 to show what a woodland it is. It's incredible, really, because it's got big trees and all that are I don't know, probably 60 foot tall, all different species, and they were all meant for, for the street. It was in the 1970s, and I think the council must have run out of money, so the place became a beautiful woodland. And there was a fair bit of digging involved in putting all those trees in. It was, uh, it was all done with spades and they didn't give us any mechanical help in those days. So, kept you fit if nothing else. <laughs> anyway, I ain't rambling on to long tonight guys, I'm just uh, going to enjoy this uh, 1792. Nice tobacco. Got, uh, it's got the old tonka bean in it, which is nice. Quite a strong one. I wouldn't say it's very strong. I don't think it's very strong. It's strong, but not. it's not overtly strong. So, anyway, guys. I hope you're having a good day and keeping fit in these times of isolation. Looks like we're going to get confined to our houses here in the UK. Way they're talking. I think um, we're going to almost make it compulsory. We'll be prisoners in our own properties. <laughs> so happy times ahead. Looks like I'll be doing more piping, and maybe more painting, all sorts of things to do anyway. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you soon. <laughs>